I am here today to tell you about one of my favorite subjects, the trench coat, and all the different ways that you can wear it. Actually, not all the different ways, because I'd be here till tomorrow, but I'm going to show you some of my favorite ways to wear a trench coat. I love a trench coat because it actually works almost anywhere in your wardrobe. It's an amazing transitional piece. It's outerwear, you can wear it indoors, you can wear it over a mini dress, you can wear it with leggings and boots, you can wear it with jeans. A million different ways to wear a trench. They never go out of style. You always need one. So today I have the incredible Nikki Dean, one of our most amazing fashion editors of the Zoe Report, and she is wearing one of my most favorite trenches, which is the classic Burberry trench in a beautiful teal blue color. I always think that it's incredibly chic, um, especially when the weather's not so great, to actually button the trench coat all the way to the top and belt it and make it almost look like you're wearing a dress over your pants or if you're just wearing tights and boots. I think that's really cool. In fact, when I went to the opening of the Burberry store many years ago, I wore a leather Burberry trench and buttoned it up and wore it as my outfit with a pair of thigh-high boots and I never felt better. It's good for work. It's great for work. And it hides a bad outfit. So that's one way, super clean and polished. I also love if you're wearing, which you are, a great button-up shirt or sweater to just have your sleeves coming out. And I often style my runway looks like this. And just push your sleeves up to wherever you feel comfortable. But I always like the shirt cuff coming out because I think it just adds a little something special. You're ready to go. You can go out. <laughs> you can go out. You're good. How do you feel? I feel great. Good. Love it. No one makes a trench like Burberry, just saying. It's like they invented it and they created the art of the trench. It was actually made for the British military. Really? Nikki mm -hmm. Dean. <laughs> fashion fun facts. facts. Fun facts. Fun fashion facts. So I'm going to turn you to the side. So this is always everyone's question because it's always that awkward like, what do you do? It's flapping when you're walking and whatever. So what I like to do is you can loosely tie it. Sometimes a trench is very boxy when it's open. So you can actually use that to your advantage. Tie it kind of a little bit tighter. So that way when it's open, you can show off your cute outfit underneath. And just tie it very neatly, very loosely. And there's no exact science to it, it's however you're comfortable. You can pull it through and make a proper knot, like that, and keep it super simple. And it doesn't look weird, it feels good, and now it opened it up a little bit so that you don't have like the vents, you know, the front of your coat just kind of flapping, because that makes me crazy. And it feels a little more cinched at the waist. Exactly. So now it kind of turned into a blazer that you're wearing with your look mm -hmm. and added a hole. I love this. Keeping it real. <laughs> Keeping it real. So I call this series the extra five because I firmly believe that an extra five minutes to throw your hair in a top knot, put on a red lipstick, add a pair of heels instead of flats, button up your shirt to the top and put on a pair of earrings, whatever that extra five minutes is for you will make a huge difference in your day, in your life, because when you look better, you feel better. Hope you guys love this extra five. Don't forget to subscribe and if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you guys have any ideas for my next extra five, please leave them in the comment box below. I'm dying to hear them. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> that's, that's, that's cute. That's, no, that's, that's cute. Yeah.